your money? Sure. Welcome to the night shift. Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Cody. The guy you see on screen is Eli, and today we have another collection from our vending machines. This includes four of our full line machines and a claw machine, so let's get right into it. But guys, just real quick, if you like these collection videos, please smash that like button and hit the subscribe button as well. It really does help us a lot, and we have many more collection videos for you guys to come. But here we are. Let's get this machine full because it is looking pretty empty. As you can see, we got our snacks to the side there. And just look at inside of this machine. It is pretty low now we have had a few questions of what we sell our product for uh, like pastries are a dollar 25 the candy is a dollar 25 as well and the one ounce chips are 75 cents so we think that's um, a pretty fair price um, given what we buy our product for so just uh, keeping that in mind and Eli's gonna go ahead and fill up the chips they do uh, like their potato chips here. Now we've had spots in the past that like, I don't know what it is, just uh, potato chips just don't really sell all that well. But um, we're trying out um, some Nutter Butters. We actually bought a whole like whole box that was just completely full of Nutter Butters because this spot just really enjoys them. So that's really good because the price on those is actually pretty cheap. So. That's actually a really good one to sell. Uh, the Oreos and the Chips Ahoy are also uh, just around the same price, if not identical. Uh, let's pull out these coins, see how she did. Very nice, it's uh, it's doing pretty good on change. Now that's probably quarters, dimes, and nickels, um, but I think I saw a, a vast majority of quarters in there. Eli will dump them into the pouch. There we go, just like that. Yeah, that's mainly just quarters, so that's uh, that's a good pull right there. Let's get into this DBA and see what she's got inside. All right, we will open the side, and bang, guys, we're looking good. Not too shabby at all. Let's get a view of that. Looking good, looking good. All right, Eli will slide that magazine back on, and we are good to go. The, uh, the Lobby Snack Machine made $74 in cash quarters and card sales for one week. So that's very, very nice. Uh, I'm happy about it. Let's go ahead and go back out to the car and grab our soda. This spot's pretty cool because they actually have a, uh, a grocery cart that we can just take in and out. Uh, they use it for all kinds of different things. You see the nurses just walking up and down the halls uh, with this grocery cart just filling it with you know just whatever but i just thought it was funny that they use a uh, a grocery cart to do that with but uh eli will take all these drinks out um oh and these teas guys um we've had we've had many requests from pretty much all of our locations except for one i think but tea is very popular and these are the drinks that are in it before and then um as soon as we get it nice and full uh, I'll show you an after of all the new drinks that we have inside or uh, like on the display and you know as something you can choose we're gonna push that red button to reset everything so if we you know when we go home and check how it's doing on sales uh, we're up to date on how everything is doing as you can see Mountain Dew is completely out and A&W root beer is looking pretty low we got it nice and full now take a look there we got the tea like I was just talking about we got the the coke bottles um, but yeah the we swapped out the drinks for uh, much better margins and we feel that uh, it'll sell better being that it's bottled like that the coke uh, Mountain Dew and sweet tea 
go around to the front here and there you go you can see the Mountain Dew the coke and the sweet tea I think those will do a lot better I don't know uh, the whole bottle thing is just way more convenient it's got you know a cap and everything let's pull out this change all right, so the Lobby Soda Machine made $89.50 in cash quarters and card sales for one week. I absolutely love it. And that was just changed that we were testing the bottles and, and seeing if it was going to work out. Uh, fine, it did. No problems at all. And there is the cash. N now, notice you see that the Mountain Dew is 24 ounce while the Cokes are still 16. We're hoping that uh, they'll sell better being bigger bottles. Uh, they do sell uh, 24 ounce Pepsis, but they don't sell it in Coke. But I'm really uh, thinking that that money uh, will really get, uh, will accumulate a lot more being that they are the bottles. But here we are now in the break room soda and snack machine and these are looking really low too alrighty let's crack into this machine and we will turn 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 that T handle and open up this machine and fill her up because she needs it and let's go ahead and fill up this snack machine we will start with the Kit Kats here this was another one that we we bought like a whole uh, box of the Kit Kats. We usually buy these like I guess they're like a mix pack and it comes with some You know some Kit Kats some Milky Ways and some other things But uh, if you buy them just individually just all Kit Kats or all Twix It does a lot better. Look at those quarters. It is doing pretty good for the break room We will dump those in that pouch is getting pretty full pretty full indeed Let's push that drawer back in there, looking good. I will hang on to the pouch. Eli will pull the money from the magazine. And guys, looky, looky, it's looking pretty good, pretty good. So let's go ahead and add that to the pouch. She's getting pretty fat, I love it. Okay, so the break room snack machine made $70 flat for the week. So crazy how there's four machines in this nursing home and they always earn around the same within $20 of each other. So insane to me. All right, we push that red button so we are good to go on the snack machine. She's looking a lot more healthier, uh, way more full than she was before. But here we are now on the soda machine, the last machine. And the coins are looking a little scarce pull the magazine out and guys take a look there she's doing a okay we are looking at 82.25 for the week and again that's uh cash coins and card so we're looking pretty good here uh we just gotta slow down the camera a little bit take a look and uh just appreciate the beauty <laughs> so uh yeah guys we are moving on next um, oh yeah, and that makes three sixteen twenty-five for the week uh, for the vending machine spots. So we're on track for a thousand dollars a month. Anyway, we are now uh, in front of our kitty crane at a Mexican restaurant where we were asked to put more animal toys, uh, and we also did uh, capsules as well. So get those looking nice and healthy and let's just dump those in spread them around a little bit we got some bracelets in there and just a bunch of little knick-knack toys some little uh play ball things and uh yeah she's looking pretty good uh let's open her up and see how she's doing all right and we will start with the quarters we were here just uh just two weeks ago so let's open her up and see how she's doing all right all right we're looking pretty fat let's take that over to the scale and see how she's doing okay we are looking at 89 25 and quarters i am happy with that i cannot complain and let's pull off this magazine and bang guys we are looking at 68 dollars in cash for a total of 157.25 and that is awesome let's uh, go put it with its family members uh, and just get a sweet spot of that slow it down a little bit and appreciate 
uh, the beauty. All right, so that makes a total for this video of 473.50, another very solid collection. And stay tuned for our upcoming collection videos. We have some crazy new machines coming in the next 30 days and can't wait to show you. Don't forget to enter our giveaway sponsored by caneymachines.com. See you in the next one. Goodbye.